So hi guys, in this video I'll be telling you how to install MIYSR Eternity in MI11X with me K40 of the POCO F3 So the prerequisites are, you need to have an unlock bootloader You can, should be on MIUI and You have to remove your MI account, you have to remove your Google accounts And remove your password and security And Head to your file manager you should be having these two files in your internal storage which is the MIYSR Eternity ROM zip and the TWRP image file uh, the MIYSR has two types of ROMs the encrypted one and the decrypted one both are just the same um, the steps for both are the same and I have chosen the encrypted one so you should also have TWRP installed now Reboot your phone into TWRP by clicking on reboot and keep on pressing the power up button. So once your recovery has booted, head into wipe, advanced wipe, select your dial the card cache and then swipe to wipe. Now go home, go to, I mean go to, go to home and then go to install and then click on MIYSR Eternity and then swipe to confirm flash. This is going to take a lot of time because the ROM size is 3.4 GB so it's going to take some time. Once the ROM has flashed, there was no errors. Now we can head into advanced, uh, click on install recovery RAM disk and then select your TWRP image and swipe to install. Now go back, go to wipe, go to format data, type in yes. Once format data is complete, we can click on reboot system. Well, here is it. The MIYSR 14 or the MIYSR Eternity has booted. Let's do a quick setup. So the setup's done. Let's enter the system. MIUI SR looks pretty good. And when it comes to MIUI ROMs, I love the SR because it's fast and smooth. First things first, let's put it to 120 Hz. Let's put it to high, I mean custom. And then let's change it to 90. I mean 120, we also have the 90Hz option. So now the ROM is pretty smooth. Let's check the MIYSR customizations. We have a control center like a different control center. Oh, that was taking some time so this was the control center but I feel the default one was pretty good so let's put it to the default so this one's pretty good and we have mount control mount for volume panel this is how the volume panel looks like we have MI Smart Play, Smart Home, Disable, Blur, Quick Launch and these, these icons are pretty good. We have so many new customizations but these take a bit time to go in. And let's come to the widgets. So these widgets are pretty cool and they are in Chinese but that's fine. I'm pretty sure we can change them. Oh we kept we keep getting widgets. And we have categories. So that is all for this video. Please stay tuned for the MIYSR review and performance video which will be coming up in the channel soon. So please like, share and subscribe. Bye.